What's up YouTube? Tenchi Arizona, the angry Dracolope of the Jackalope crew here and shooting with Uncle Dan, you magnificent Texan bastard. This one is for you. And why is it for you? Because you, you bastard, you got me looking at fucking swords, even though I know fuck all about them. And I've already found one that I like. And that is the Hanway Practical Tai Chi Sword which costs around £130 and as swords go that is a fucking amazing price so I may just have to get one now aside from swords and fuck you for making me look at swords you bastard fuck you indeed because damn oh I fucking hate you for this but yeah swords are amazing I like all blades I like many kinds of different weapons and you may hear some planes in the background because there is an air festival on at the moment and once I finish this video, I'll try and get some footage of the air festival for you, if I can. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I've been looking at some swords, several in fact, and the Hanway Practical Tai Chi sword really, really caught my eye. It's a really nice design, and quite honestly, it's a good price. Now, also, I want to get a kukri, but... There's so many fucking kukri designs out there that I can't decide which one to get. I have decided that I want to get a proper Nepalese kukri first. Uh, not just because they are more cost effective than the Condor ones, but because they are completely authentic. Nepal is, Nepal is where they originated. That's where the Gurkhas originated. So yeah, I would definitely want to get a traditional Nepalese kukri. But if... The guys at Condor, and I mean you Joe Flowers, if you want to send me one to review, feel free to get in touch with me by my email, which is on my about page on the YouTube. <laughs> if you want to send me one for review, that's brilliant. If not, don't worry about it guys, seriously. But yeah, I would seriously love to get one of those to review. And honestly, the Condor blades I have at the moment, the Swamp Romper and the Mayflower, I have to admit, and I fucking hate admitting this, I have to admit that the Mayflower is growing on me. At first, I absolutely despised that knife because it came extremely dull, but after sharpening it, it's really kind of growing on me. And I'm quite surprised by that because I was not expecting to ever, ever like the Mayflower. The Swamp Romper, by the way, is actually my favourite Condor knife. And my favourite large blade at the moment, it's kind of a 50-50 mix. I love the Tops to Homer Field knife, but I also love my Ontario SP-10 Marine Raider Bowie. That thing is a fucking beast. And it, it just makes me smile. Every time I fucking pick that blade up, I'm like, yeah, that's amazing. <laughs> Uh, and I'm not crazy Rob I just really like to get my hands on good blades and I would be the same if I got my hands on a good firearm although I cannot do that being where I am so being able to get my hands on a really good quality Bowie mm, that's just it's up there <laughs> it's like friggin Aquaman getting his golden trident anyway Back to shooting with Uncle Dan. He is a really good guy. He has amazing content when he does post content. So I would appreciate it if you guys go and check him out. Go check out his YouTube channel. And Uncle Dan, if you watch this, start putting out some more content. Because trust me, if you keep putting out content like you have done in the past, you are going to grow far beyond what you thought you would. Trust me, it happened to me. I never thought I would get to where I am now, currently at around 223 subscribers, and I couldn't be happier. And I'm getting consistent growth as well. The watch time is good and all that. I think I mentioned that in the previous video. Anyway, shooting with Uncle Dan. This video was for you, you magnificent bastard. Anyway, that's all for now. If you like it, like it, please subscribe, comment, and share. And remember, be good to each other.